Yo, what is going on, guys? It's me, Joban, aka J Force. You have known. Um, yeah, yeah. If you've seen the description down below, um, this is um, to tell. Um, it's a s way to solve your GTA Five crashing problem. Um, basically, what happened is um, I just bought a new GPU two days ago, which you can see on my previous video, and um, I, and on the same day. Windows 10 had released, Microsoft had released a new update for Windows 10, so I updated it. Then, um, everything works fine. Then I, then, then I started playing CSGO, CSGO played fine. And then when I want to play GTA 5, this problem happens. Whenever, it, it, it can launch, it can launch. But whenever I touch the mouse or move the mouse or click on any keys on the keyboard, it will just crash. Every time it will just crash, no matter what I do. It will say GTA 5 has stopped working and it's very frustrating. Um, and I try to find solution but I can't find anything on Google. I can't find this solution on Google, YouTube, um, other software, uh, other hardware website like Tom's Hardware, NCX and all stuff. And even Rockstar support, I don't see any things any solutions so this leaves me because I want to play GTA 5 badly and um, I can't say I'm a computer expert but um, I like to create software and I like to work around with computers so I even create this software you can see it's, uh, it's a PC fix software but uh, there's nothing important now here um, so I have to find out myself so um, I have posted a discussion on Steam and um, only one guy he has the same problem as me I don't know this many of you have this problem because it's quite rare um, but um, yeah I found a solution to it it's good news and hopefully I can solve your problem so um, what I did was um, because um, I tried the ways I do is reinstall the driver, um, update everything, scan for malware and stuff, disable antivirus. Um, I even do the changing DirectX 11 to DirectX 10 trick is yeah by changing the settings on your GTA 5 by changing the DirectX version to one to one. Um, then you can. Uh, most people has most people when trying this one it works for them so you can can try it first um, second and then um, but to me it don't work so um, what I do what I was thinking is that um, it was the keyboard and the mouse causing this problem so what relates me to this one to this problem was the Razer software so the Razer software I tried I tried updating it still can't I trying to go offline nothing happens so um so I think of something. There's maybe some other software running inside the Razer software which Razer don't want you to know which I found out. It is the uh I'll show you guys right now. So uh, what you're gonna do is uh go to search Windows. I'm using Windows 10 right now, but um other version of Windows you you go into um system configuration. Okay, you click on it and you go down to services. You can see those services running on your PC and maybe on your PC. So um, you scroll all the way down to Razer. Uh, right now you can see they have uh, Razer have two software. One is the Razer Chroma SDK service, which is the Razer Synapse software. And the second one is the Razer Game Scanner, which is unknown. I don't know if it's a virus or something, or it's Razer implementing something, which I don't know. And um, this is the service that is causing GTA 5 not launching. Maybe other games, maybe except for GTA 5, for for I, I don't know, I don't know. So um, I stop it, and um, and bam, it just solved my problem immediately. So I'm able to play GTA 5 right now. Um, and I'm very glad that I solved it because
because uh, I think I'm the only YouTube down here, YouTube channel down here which I found the problem. Because I can't find it, I can't find it anywhere that can solve this problem. Um, so, yeah, if you guys like this video, you guys can share it. So, um, if one of your friend or anyone has this problem, can post this video and it will solve their problem. And um, if you like this video, please give it a like. Uh, if you uh, dislike it, just give it a subscribe, maybe. There will be more videos, other videos you may you might like in the future. And um, if you have any problem related to game launch, anything, you can just, if you have any PC problem, just post it in the comment section down below. And I'll try my best to help you out because I'm really interested in PC. Um, I'm designing software, creating stuff solving issues and stuff um, yeah so um, just feel free to leave in a comment session when I go free I will try to solve it for you and I'll reply to you so uh, yeah so that's what I have to say um, thanks for watching guys and um, I'll see you guys um, in the next video so peace out